morning everyone and welcome to a new vlog a new day in my life i'm still in dc time so i woke up quite early i think like 6 or 6 30 and um i actually spent this whole morning editing a new vlog i unfortunately didn't finish it yet so i still have a lot of editing to do but before I'm going to continue with editing, it is time to get started <laughs> with my day. I have some errands to run, I need to drop off some of my clothes at the dry cleaners, and then I also need to send a letter, so I need to go to the postal office. And after that, I have two very exciting meetings. First, I have a workshop at the YouTube headquarters in LA, which is super, super exciting. It is called Recharge, and I think it's focused on avoiding feeling burned out and stressed, and also kind of like re-evoking your creativity. So that sounds very interesting and promising. And, you know, even though a lot of people don't feel like YouTube is a real job, I'm telling you it is, and um, I definitely... I'm juggling so many things at the same time that I sometimes feel like I am getting quite burned out. So I feel like this is quite helpful for me, but also for, you know, any of you guys. I feel like our generation is a generation of people working extremely hard and being like on all the time with social media and everything. So I definitely know some people in my circle of friends that had or have a burnout, which you know, they're like the most hardworking people that I know, they never complain. So the fact that they had a burnout, that really opened my eyes that I need to be maintaining my physical, but also mental health. So I'm excited for this workshop. And after that, I have a meeting with Pretty Little Thing at their headquarters in Melrose or on Melrose Avenue. And it's like all pink. So I'm really excited to visit their office. Um, so yeah, that is the plan for today. I am quickly going to make this very cozy bed and then I'll change and head out the door to run my errands. <laughs> veggie burger from Trader Joe's together with some baby kale, baby spinach, um, also some arugula, basil, cherry tomatoes and sour cream together with a smoothie and in the smoothie I added some frozen berries, banana, coconut milk and spinach. So bon appetit! As you can see I just came out of the shower and I'm quickly going to apply a face mask on my face. Um, because my skin can use a little bit of TLC. And um, yeah, my skin actually, it's a little bit red right now, especially because I self tan. So as you can see, it's like a very big color difference with my face and my neck. But other than that, my skin is looking so much better than um, it did a few weeks ago. I really think the weather here in LA is way better for my skin. I think the weather in DC was too humid for my skin and it broke me out. So the mask I'm going to use today, let me quickly grab it for you. This is the mask I'm going to be using today and it's the Chorus Pomegranate AHAs and Enzymes Resurfacing Mask. It looks like this. Um, I've never tried it before but Chorus is a Greek pretty much all natural skincare brands and it is honestly one of my favorite skincare brands ever and when i got this in the goodie bag of one of the events that i went to recently i was so excited because i would usually go to greece every year and stock up on my chorus skincare because i love it that much and um, everything smells so good and so amazing so i'm really excited to try this out i'm not going to do anything fancy with a brush i'm just gonna apply it with my fingers so it smells really good actually and it has a little bit of a scrub in it which is interesting i do feel it tingle a little bit which is very normal for um ahas but it's not anything 
unpleasant so i don't think this has a very high percentage of aha which is honestly um good because um with the sun in la being very very strong i don't like to use peelings that much because i feel like it makes my skin too thin the mask is on and it says that i have to leave it on for three to five minutes so that's pretty short maybe i'll leave it on a little bit longer because um i like to do that so guys it is quite a little bit later and i spent the whole morning it's now already 11 30 working on my new supplied by lily stationery i was going through all the pages of the supplied by lily student desk planner as well as the supplied by lily lifestyle desk planner i was actually going through all the pages all the different spreads and kind of analyzing and reflecting on them if i like the way i created them or if i can change them if i can add something to it if i just want to remove them so i kind of made a word document about all the different pages and um, i also put out some stories um, asking you guys if you liked um, you know all the different spreads all the different pages I had and what you would change so um, yeah I haven't finished it because it's honestly so much work um, but I did almost finish the supplied by Lily um, student desk planner pages so that's great because that's already a lot of work <laughs> The outfit that I'm wearing right now, I think it is super, super cute. Um, this jacket is actually from For Love and Lemons, which is one of my favorite brands. I didn't buy this jacket, I actually am renting it. It is from Rent the Runway. I had a collab with them on my Instagram. I'm not collaborating with them for this video, but I just think it is such a cool concept. For $100 a month, you can rent four items at the same time and you can exchange them as often as you want so you kind of have like this infinite closet uh, with a lot of beautiful designer brands and you know more niche designer brands not only is it great because you all of a sudden have way more options to wear it is also really good for the environment and one of the main reasons why i became vegetarian three years ago was for environmental reasons so i try to you know do my part in saving this planet so you know as a fashion lover and working in fashion it's kind of hard to you know not work with brands not have a lot of clothing but by renting your clothes you still have like different outfit options anyways uh, the top that i'm wearing is also new it is from free people and i got it through uh, lulu's my necklaces are my go-to necklaces from ana luisa um i also have a discount code for you guys for ten dollars off I'll link it in the description box. Then um, I'm wearing my Gucci belt and these thrifted Levi shorts that I thrifted like six years ago, but they're still awesome. And my Chloe bag. So that's a quick outfit of the day for you guys. Um, what I'm going to do right now is uh, actually drop off this jacket. I'm not going to wear it the rest of the day. I'm going to send it back to rent a runway. So I have to drop it off at a UPS store whatever and then i also have to go to trader joe's to get some breakfast to get some and then i also have to go to trader joe's to get some food some lunch so yeah that is the plan um and i'm going to take you with me because i'm also going to cycle for the first time in la i shook my bicycle from dc to la and today is the first time that i'm going to actually cycle on it and see how crazy the traffic is here in LA because I'm a little bit worried uh, but everything is pretty close to me so you know I don't have to cycle for like sure so I don't have to cycle for like 30-40 minutes uh, so I think I'll be fine but yeah that was a very long monologue now it's time to continue with the day <laughs> So guys, I quickly wanted to show you, this is the bag that all your rental runway stuff comes in and um, 
this really cute baby. This is from Philip Lim. And um, the color is kind of interesting. So I don't think I would ever buy this myself. It is also really small. Um, like my hands are even small. So you can see how small this bag is. But it's cute, you know, it's cute for a night out. Then there's obviously this beautiful jacket that really reminds me of Dior, to be honest. And last but not least, you can't really see it that well, but this is also a beautiful dress from For Love and Lemons. Time to pack it up. So there you go. Uh, time to drop it off at a UPS store. <laughs> quite the productive day so I just ordered myself some umami burger <laughs> you guys know I'm obsessed with umami burger um, I try to eat it like once a week and not more but this is already my second time this week guess who got her burger delivery it's me <laughs> um, I ordered the impossible truffle maker that's the burger I always order it's my favorite and also some fries the baby is in here. Time for a quick outfit of the day. And uh, today I'm really liking my outfit. I think it is a really cute look. And um, yeah, I can't wait to share the details with you guys. I got this really cute blazer and short set from Lulu's. Um, it was gifted, by the way, so just to put it out there so you guys know. Um, then I'm wearing this bralette that I got from Oisho, which is an um, underwear brand from Greece, or at least I got it in Greece. It's like a bralette and it's very flattering and I love the uh, blush pink shade. Then my shoes are Coach. I always wear these, I really like them. Um, I'm wearing some necklaces from Ana Luisa as well as my rings and then I'm wearing this really cute bag from C by Chloe. So um, yeah, now it is time to go. I don't want your number now. I don't want to give you mine at now. I don't want to meet you nowhere now.